Today we're gonna learn how to basically remove the FRP lock on this phone. If you see, basically when we go back, the main screen we're stuck with this. But welcome. Then you're gonna see that this is gonna come up with some kind of error when I hit next. It's gonna say to verify the account. So I'm gonna show you guys a way to bypass all this. Um, There's a few ways to do it. So basically, I'm just gonna make it simple. Go back here, uh, and then you're gonna go advanced options and whatever network. You're gonna try and say like, type a manual proxy. So just touch that and then hit manual and then slide down onto this field for whatever letters. Select those letters that you just picked. And then you're gonna have this come up. Hit the three dots, assist. And then at that point the problem should come up. There you go. Okay, so from here you basically when you're here in the Google search, you're gonna go test. VPC APK and then you're not gonna get the question now we're gonna go for the downloader you're gonna go for this the older version the 2.0.6 it's gonna be an APK mirror you're gonna download it the idea is that this application will allow you to take ownership over the account manager it's locking your phone to your previous account and from there you can basically force your way in so after this gets downloaded you're going to execute right away and after this then you should be able to get in but not much not really much of a problem so this thing cooperates oh there we go So we get this one. Then we open it. Test the PC. We install it. Then it's already installed. Then we open it. Then we set up device owner. Click the setup. Set up. Okay. This is gonna trigger a bunch of errors. gonna try and just basically run the go back so basically what we try to do after that is we're gonna go back to this screen um, where we can basically execute anything and we're gonna look for the same map we just run that gave us the error and at this point you already have access to the phone and from here you can do a bunch of things including pretty much reset the phone So let me see. There you're gonna go to wipe data. That should take care of everything. And then here gonna have also wipe FRP of course external storage and we hit OK I have to give it some time but by the time it comes back you should own the phone again you should be able to get through with no problems and then this works for a few models um, tested with this one it's one of the rare ones. This time it may take a little while to load up.
Okay, I'm sorry. It took a while to load up, but the idea is this. You get to this point, hit next. I'm gonna escape. I have to go. Yeah, no, I'm not even gonna have to connect anymore because it's already gone, so it doesn't really require to get connected. As you can see, I'm getting through the whole thing. No warning coming up regarding the false password or anything. So, ideally, this method works for certain phones, home motos, that's kind of where I discovered it. Um, Man, but basically here I'm fully in. As you can see, have access to the phone. No accounts are attached to it. Go to settings. No users. No nothing. It's all clean. Just me. So you can do the same for your phone. Um, a good alternative method for other models as well. Uh, I hope it helps some people out there. Thank you.